Hey guys, Model Rocks 321 here. As you can tell by the title on this video that things have changed. Things are probably done. This is normally my entrance to the field. There is a fence here now, as you can see. That is not a welcoming sign. And on the other side of this fence, there's this sign right here. So when you're on that side, it's letting you know something. A while ago when I came, I saw some orange marks on the ground right here. But now it is definitely sealed off from entering right here. This dirt road on the other side, you can drive back there. That's where I would normally drive and park. But sometimes I would park behind me and then just enter right here. So this spot is no longer a thing. I will be no longer flying here as of right now. Um, there's more to the story. I did seek permission. Um, it was not granted, but I have another number to call from the same person that could not grant permission. Because this is all res land. If you know anything about reservations, it is typically not, it is frowned upon. I mean, I've been flying here for years and have never, ever, ever saw a res cop. Like if you head further south that way, there is more restrictions on it. Um, but can't be here. I'm not saying I should should be here, but right now I cannot be here on that side flying in this field. So we are dead in the water. And I want to show you guys one more thing that pretty much sealed the deal because I could still drive back here. There's no problem. I can get back there, but stay tuned. And we're going to go take a quick peek at one more thing that kind of sealed the deal on this great, great flying field. And with that being said, also I want to say, guys, um, if you're in Arizona, if you have land if you know anybody that has access to land that wouldn't mind doing some business you know we're fully insured as NAR members land will be you know clean and taken care of when I'm flying on it um, email is modelrocks321 at yahoo.com that'll be on the screen for this video so send an email contact me we can work out something payment if you don't mind me coming and making my videos but stay tuned let's take a look at this right here Alright guys, so I just wanted to show you guys this um, further reason as to why I am done. This is a fresh, you can see that sign right there, this is a fresh brand new sign stating what it is. Um, so here it is, it's a tribal land, Hill of River Indian community, no shooting or trespassing, no dumping, no removal of native plants. So you can see that right there that things have changed a whole lot. Um, with this sign being up so this is the flying field I was normally on that side down there I launched over here one time um, and a guy came up he wasn't native or anything he wasn't what he just came out let me know that hey this is res land he actually worked he actually worked at over there it's a, a hospital or something over there he worked at and he walked down the field letting me know saying something so you know we talked and um for a minute he said hey if you want to um, email to try to get permission and that's why I, I went that route but the guy he was very nice he said hey i can't grant it because we don't the native american, native american community runs this land but they are leases so this property is leased out there's a plane up there this property is leased out so you just got to find which section you want to lease or borrow or use or whatever and then you go from that point um but that's where things stand right now so as far as me flying here that is a done deal i like to fly solo it's a lot of fun but i have flown in clubs before so i will be flying in clubs here and there but model rock is three two one may be done as of right now but like i said if you have land or if you have access to land or somebody knows land email is on the screen you send me an email and we can get it worked out especially if you're in arizona um so I'm still trying to fly solo, but I will be flying with Sarah. Shout out to Sarah. That's the Tucson Club. And I will be flying with my old club, which is Super, Superstition Space Modeling. I mean, these are far drives. I mean, <laughs> we're driving out like from where I'm at. It's, these are two hour drives each way. So I think um, the one in Tucson is like an hour and a half or hour 40 minutes, something away, which is not too bad. But the other are solid two hour Superstition. We used to fly in Goodyear, which was 45 minutes to 50 minutes from the city. But... This is still all local. This is like right near where I'm at. This is it's perfect. I've been coming here for years, but now things are getting more serious. They put a fence up 
which may be that property owner over there. And I totally get it. You know, it's people's land. I mean, nobody don't want you in their land. If I had land, I wouldn't want anybody on it without permission. I mean, if they ask, sure, I would um, definitely let somebody, we'll have to do paperwork for insurance and stuff like that. But I totally get it. So I'm not, you know, too upset. I had it. While I had it, it was great. <laughs> had some great flights here. A lot of fun here. If you've been around Model Rock 321 and you've been following the videos, you see it was um, a great time flying out here. But I'm not, I just got to know when to hold them and when to fold them and when to walk away and that's what i'm doing even though i've never seen in all the years i've never seen a res cop not once come here i've seen srp and different electric companies because they use this road to gain access to underneath the freeway and all some area that road go, it goes all the way back it goes way over there so that's um that's where we stand right now like i said um not a lot of flying but I do have a number to call, like I said. So things may not be done totally. I have a number to call and I can get some more information. They were generous. They gave me the number what I need to call and to follow up and pursue to see if I can get access to where I'm at right now. Um, so, and my thing was always just fly until I can't fly no more here. But I will be doing some park flights in, um, cause parks are pretty here. I checked into it. There's a lot of parks you can fly in, um, fly. I know Mob Rockets, um, Michael, I know he's um, checked into a lot of parks where you can fly. Um, nothing usually above a D engine, so I will be checking into some of that. But as of right now, in this location, it was, it was great. Like I said, I was back over that way. Flew here once, ran into this guy, start pursuing some things, kind of laid low, and then fence and this sign. This sign is um, a new. <laughs> this sign just went up, you know, very recently. This is not a old sign. Um, but they just don't, and it's a lot of dumping took place out here. I can see where it's just stuff got dumped. So they don't, that's one thing people ruin it. The other side wasn't much dumpy because there was no road really access and it's more visible. This is tucked away. People come out here and dump. I see like heavy cement, like people dump like big chunks of trash and garbage out here. But gotta respect the land and I do. So, you know, I just came, never, never tried to abuse it. I always just wanted to fly and, you know, do my thing and, and get out. Um, that was it. But the numbers on the screen if you have access or know a lead to some land um we're on to pay i'm willing to sign a waiver releasing them of any uh you know injuries or anything that would happen um we're NAR members so we're all insured was it a million or five million i always forget we're insured you know so as NAR members national association of rocketry members we get that insurance property and um personal damage so that's where model rocks 321 stand Thank you guys for all the support and we will see i will be doing some club launches and some smaller stuff and i have some other ideas too for some videos and things like that but we will see you around it's model rock 321 signing off support the channel any way you can still guys websites up check the store some stuff in there some merch in there got some items in there some rockets in there stuff's coming so got some stuff i'm gonna be um, releasing for you guys so here we go and we are out check this video at the very end of this one Model Rockets 3, 2, 1.